You and me stuck on the ocean now Nothing but waves and they're spilling in I wanna dry up but you Just keep on going, don't you? I don't even know how we got here All my reasoning have disappeared I wanna bury the hatchet And find the way back to our home Our home, our home We don't have to drift inside this dome I will not let us fade away It's not a price I want to pay Alright guys, so as promised, I'm just going to show you how I fill it these quickly. I'm not an expert, um, but I do certainly manage to get a decent fillet off and mostly all I'm left with is just bone at the end. And the fillet's are also boneless as well, so this is how uh, I was taught to do it. The most important thing is guys, a sharp knife. Uh, make sure your hands are clean. Rinse the fish off if you can, it gets a lot of the slimy stuff off. And um, most important thing is, uh, second most important thing is a towel. Um, you put the fish on top of the towel, it stops it from sliding around in the basin. And um, I would normally use a towel, but my girlfriend obviously doesn't want me to, but I'd normally just sneak one on there and do it without and I would mince to get in the washing machine. Like, I'll get up. She'll have me for that one. So this is, guys, this is a, how I fill it a place. To so start off, um, down the centre of the fish here, we're just going to cut a line down the centre of the fish. So just mark, mark yourself a line and then just cut into the fish like this. They are quite a tough fish to get through, but I find this is a really good way to get the fillets off. And it's very similar to the way I will fillet a bass. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to scrape the knife across the bone. Did you can just hear that? Try and cut away from myself, as you guys keep saying. Bad habits. And then I'm just li literally all I'm doing, guys, is I'm lifting that fillet off the bone trying to make sure there's no bone uh, in the fillet. It's quite easy to do it this way. It takes a little bit of time to get it right and I'm not perfect at it. But just to give you guys an idea on how it's done. So I'll just show you guys one fillet. Uh, and it's the same underneath as well. If you feel a bit of bone on your fillet, just go above it and push it down. We'll get that bone out of the way then. place definitely are not my favourite fish to fill it and I'll just put a cut up here somewhere that's where my fillet will start like I say guys bass are definitely a lot easier to get a fillet off but This way works as good as any. The only bit I struggle with is a bit around the guts. That bit I always find a bit tricky. Um, but just work around, work around the fillet slowly, and then when you're done, just cut round, um, cut round where you think the fillet's going to end. The, the meat on the end it is no good anyway because it's so thin. So just start a slice about there, and then you can just pull the rest of that fillet off. Try. Always trying to get as much meat off as you can, um, and you can trim the edges if you don't want the bits that are just skin. Uh, you can trim them towards the end. So there you go, guys. That's our four place fillets that we managed to get off the one fish, uh, nice and boneless. I'm going to fire those up in butter in a minute for me and the kids to eat. I know there's not a lot, but for me, eating fish is more of a celebration of my catch. <laughs> and a good bit of health for the family than it is about getting full up. I caught, between me and Peter, we had 22 place and we only took one. So sustainability is key and um, taking loads of fish for me is just a big no, something I've never been into. I always like to release them if I can, but when a decent dinner size one comes up, I've got to take the opportunity to give my kids some nice, sustainable, freshly caught sea fish. Is there a way to cool it down quicker? Just blow it. Mate, that was caught like an hour ago. Huh? Filleted, nice. cooked. It is so nice. It is. Have you got some? 
Yeah, I've had some. Okay, that's good. Why don't you have some more? Mum's gonna try some. So nice, Mum. Eat it then. I'm blowing it. What? Eat it. Mm. <laughs> so. I don't want to eat the camels. Nom 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 nom. Well, I can.